All right, everyone, ready up. All right, let's get it. You go on the roof, we'll take the side windows. Can I ball for a minute? Ride right on. I got this, let it roll like a night storm. Forever winning, don't you ever get They're it wrong, babe? Because otherwise, I'm going to rise up in your face. I said the trip wire. Somebody cover the windows. I've got the ceiling. I think we're back. That was scary. IBS crashed on me. Um, yeah. That could be problematic. I seem to be having some issues with my system, so I'm not quite sure how reliable the stream is going to be. Look, we're going to soldier on regardless, and hopefully everything is going to turn out okay. Anyway, uh, not quite sure how much of that intro came through before, so uh, I might just repeat it all anyway. Um, coming at you live, well, hopefully live, uh, from the VRML matchup between Hybrid and Emugi. Let's see if I can set up the screens properly. Now, this is my first cast since they've uh, released the new update. The whole uh, seeing through the walls thing is going to be really new. It's going to be quite interesting to see how uh, this all works out as we kick into hideout. Quick look at the teams we've got in soon. Cambo, Battle Rose, Scabby, and oh dear, it looks like uh, Amugi are running with four. Uh, they're up against Bailey, Ebob, Peen, Chase Attack, and Axolotl. Now, it's only eight minutes past, so I thought they would have waited a little bit longer for their extra player to get in, but anyway, they're running with a bot. Really amazing how you can see the characters through the walls. The only disadvantage is you're not quite sure which room they're in. The bot's tucked in the corner. Yeah, the wall goes down. Ebob is very low. Peen takes out Battle Rose. Where was that done? Bailey gets a meal. Oh, the bot, of course. I've lost track of him. Oh, there's Peen. He must have been tucked way back there on the uh, on the creek bed. Meanwhile, you got one watching B, two in the uh, storage area. As they push in, Insong gets Bailey. Axo gets Insong back as a refrag. And Scabby gets E Bob as he comes in the door. Oh, Axolotl gets Scabby, and that's the end of a movie's run. Hybrid take the first round.
Quickly, the score shows this kills are quite evenly spread with uh, Axolotl got the slight advantage. top floor this time and they're gonna go for the roof to blow the hatch now despite winning that first round hybrid have opted to eco this round they're all running pistols again Meanwhile, Moogie, you've got uh, three rifles going on as the timer kicks off. He looks like he's trying to peek. Oh, he takes out Scabby there. They pushed in, they have. Drone goes in. Smoke goes down. They are foaming that wall. They're going to breach in there. I wonder if... Oh, it's the bot. Oh, oh Chase gets an easy pick on that one. Insom going to try to get the refresh. Oh, he doesn't. Axo shoots Bailey in the back. You'll hear about that one for the rest of the night. Oh, what do we got? Prince takes out Gambo. Hybrid take the second round as Epoch takes out Battle Rose, the final player. They move to two. So we got a mid-floor this time, and looks like I'm going to do a garage push, maybe? Maybe go for the hatches. Axo and Chase both on three kills leading the way. Drone's going to go in under the door just to make sure that they can get in the garage safely. Get shot down pretty quick as there's two in there. They push in anyway. No, they throw the... What was that? A nade, maybe. Oh, Scabby gets Bailey. As he's peeking the door. A nade and a flash go in. They're not following up, though. Scabby gets the bob. Must have peeked that one. Chase is charging in. He gets one. He doesn't know Insung's there. No, rotating around. Insung's gonna see him first and get the kill. Insung gets Axo also hanging out, so we're down to 1v3. Peen on his own. He is cloaked though. I was waiting for him just around the corner. Moogie, take their first point. Look at that, three kills apiece across the board by three of them anyway. Scabby Insong and Cambo. Floor this time. Looks like we might have a roamer on the stairs, maybe. Yeah, scabby.
looks like a fairly standard gymnasium push. Gonna breach that wall and try and get in there. Static is down in anticipation, and we've got a bot still. On a moogie. And down a plane. Track attention. Certainly getting that. You guys decided to push. No. That's a hatch, I think. That'll be the storage hatch, maybe. Might have been B hatch. Yeah, B hatch. Oh, we're getting close here. Yeah, here we go. We've got some contact in some takes out Evo. Quickly rotates away. Chase must have been grabbing the holding the MP. Chase. Oh, tries to get a cheeky around the corner. Hey, he gets taken out by Insong for his troubles. Down to a 3v4. 3v5, actually. There's five there. Still left. Oh, we've got one outside. He's just giving his position away. He's trying to pick out someone on the roof, maybe. Bait them. Because there's only three. He wants to know where they are. Oh, we've got Bailey deciding to circle around. Who's he shooting at? Oh, okay. Yep. The other two, where are they gone? Oh, right out here. I'm gonna drop storage straight into trouble by the look of that. In the form of Cabby and Cambo. One down. Bailey gets Cambo. Two of them in there. They don't know Scabby's there though. He pops around the corner. He doesn't feel. Ping takes him out. Ping gets another one. Insul is the one that finally is left alive. Uh, actually, no, Battle Rose was as well, so. Uh, Imugi get to two points. And so leading the charge with six kills. Still got a bot on a Moogie. I'll be scratching to find a fifth to fill that, I'm sure. Battle Rose has got a nice roam going on up the top floor. is blowing that window so they'll probably know he's there. <laughs> Bailey's going to try and peek. He bobs with him. Oh, Ping gets in song. Where did that happen? the garage. And he's only got a pistol too. He's got spectral, I think. He's going to push and try and take that garage. Oh, Camo gets Bailey. He throws a nade in. Doesn't get any... Doesn't look like it does any damage either. No rotating back to Peen. Well, if he 
these two over here are still they're in actually Ebob and uh, who's there chase Just holding that corner. Ambo's come out. Oh, you got E-Bob coming through that door. All of a sudden, Hybrid are just not keen to push anymore. Uh, down to three. Where's their third? Where's their third? Bot's still alive. Can't believe that. I usually the first to die. Oh, you run straight past that doorway. Didn't get tagged. He's going for the plant. They're coming in connected. Oh, no, he's got that covered. Although, no, Cambo took out Chase. Scabby takes out XOP. Scabby on the refresh. Oh, he also gets Cambo. And there's only just 1v2. Oh, that's it. Battle Rose takes him out and goes in for the defuse. And a Moogie take that round. And they take the lead as well. Moving to three versus two. Uh, now this will be the final round before they switch sides and we've got Camo and Insung both on six kills. We've got Peen on seven kills. He's got the assists. Uh, three assists for both Scabby and Bailey. Meanwhile, Bot Emil has yet to score a kill and has died three times. Ground floor once more. Might be going to push in through the wine cellar, I would imagine. And Bailey's not so sure. Well, he's going to watch that window first. Oh, Chase is engaging already. Straight into that. They've rotated out of there as hybrid push into the wine cellar. It is server, or what do we call the games room? But it's actually server. Area. Oh, nice nade! Oh, that takes out Insung. That was beautiful. Still trying to work that corridor. Gets pain. Where did that happen? Axo's trying to flank. He's holding a line though, Cambo. No, he's not. He's just tucked in the corner. Oh, he might be. He is. He's holding that line. He's trying to get the peak. He got some damage. Oh, he does. He picks him up. Rotating back. Meanwhile, Scabby peeks Bailey down the corridor. We need to blow that wall. Where he's got. Oh, yep. They're ready for the flash. Three. I can only see two. Oh, yeah. Oh. Chase is trying to sneak in the window and he's in. I don't think they know he's there. In fact, there's no one there actually. Oh yeah, he's behind the bar. That's what I mean by about depth perception. It's a bit hard to see. He gets a cheeky kill on Battle Rose. Meanwhile, Emil's coming through connector. 
she's gonna get aggressive now though. As the EMP goes down. Chase is gonna find out very quickly. No, right in the middle where it takes away. But it's it's Scabby that's gotta do all the work. Can't rely on a bot to carry the team. And he's up against three. And they've got that locked down. Oh, there it goes. Oh, he picks up Ebob first. Uh, and Exo gets the refrag. And they will be switching sides. Indeed, they will. Uh, and they go to three apiece. So this is a tight one. I'd like to see a close match. All right, let's see what the movie can do on attack. Still have a bot. That is a crying shame. Might have fixed that actually. I have a feeling I didn't need to do that. Alright. Where are they? Pushing through the main door. Oh, only because that's the bot where the bot's going. Refrain King gets that cheap um, cheap kill on the bot and Battle Rose is not in the right place to get a refrag. His peen is out of there. In fact, he looks like he's on the stairs. Uh, so, oh, here we go. They are pushing into the garage. Chase gets two. out of there he's rotated away uh, and there is still one over here though battle rose he'd be looking to link up because there is only two left and they're up against the full hybrid team he's not they're still on opposite sides of the map these two Battle Rose is in. He's sneaking up the stairs. He's going to try and see if he can flank one. He's got 90 seconds to do it. Now we might get these two run into each other. Peen's on the stairway, and Scabby's right above him. I don't think he knows he's there. He's going to find out right now. Peen takes him out, and it's just Battle Rose left, and he doesn't have the EMP. He picks up Ebob peeking out the doorway, though. That's a handy little kill. But he's still got four hybrid players to deal with. And 36 seconds to do something about it. Oh, he gets Bailey. That was a nice one. That'll hurt their economy. Down to the last 10 seconds. Oh. Oh, oh, that was a pretty crazy kill. Dropped down from above and... Took him out. I don't think he knew what, what hit him. Uh, Peen moves to 10 kills. We've got Chase on 9 and Scabby and Cambo on the other side with 7 apiece. Now... Still got bottom meal. In fact, she got a kill. 
know. She didn't. Five points must have been an assist, maybe. I don't know. No, they're all deaths. Five deaths. Yeah. <laughs> All right, 20 seconds to go for the next round. Round number eight. Harvey's back in the lead with four points. What did Moogie do? I'm gonna try and push in through that door, that window maybe. Certainly might catch them out if they don't know they're there, and I don't think they do. Are well, they going to do a big swing in? Or... No, the other two on the top are rotating away. Where's the fifth? Where's the fifth? He's primed his nade, so Axolotl, I think, realizes that someone's there. Um, he's given it to Evolve, I think. They definitely, they definitely know someone's there. And they're going to swing in. Here it comes. Flash goes in. I think he flashed himself. Two dead. Three dead. Oh, four dead. And I don't know where the fifth was, but wow, that was a killing zone, that one. I think it can work, but uh, it just didn't that time. P moves to 11 with kills and chase with 10. Hybrid take. Five points, and they need two more points to lock this one down. Axolotl and Bailey in their ritual, They're doing their dancing powder cake thingy. got a meal and she's gonna plow straight through that front front door well, the rest of the team they are rotating right around to the garage I would imagine goes in, doesn't get anyone. Oh, flash doesn't get anyone either. Cambo's in already. He's gonna choke out Chase. No, Chase gets him. Someone else gets the replay going. Oh, oh, action of plenty. This down a 2v3. Bob goes down somewhere else. Oh, Insulin gets a nice easy kill on Bailey's. He's looking the wrong way. But he's trapped down there. Once they know he's there, he gets peen. In fact, it's down to a 1v1. It's just E Bob left. And he's found a stem, so he's getting the health back. Only one hundred. He's got full health now. Evob's on uh, seventy-six. He's got the EMP. Looks like he's farming that wall. Evob's gonna stay put, hoping he gets the peak. And oh, in some season first. Moogie's coming back. Four points to five. Insong moves to nine kills.
Now it doesn't look like a lot of traps are going down. Everybody's buying guns by the look of this. Song has got a Vezin, so's Cambo, so's Battle Rose, Scabby as well, and Emil. Well, she's got an omen. Oh, Axo gets the bot already. It's only the bot, so nothing you'd excite, too excited about. Must have been from a breach or a roof or a hatch or something. Anyway. Ensign's pushing in. Into the bedroom he's got. He's got support. Chase gets camo. Where did that happen? Down the corner by the look of that. Ensign gets Bailey. Scabby takes out Chase in the corner. He's too dead there. Oh, Evob gets Ensign. Two left alive. But they again, they're not linking up though. Oh, yes, they are. Yes, they are. There's an attempted wall banging. We've got someone down there trying to. Axo's trying to hold a nice little line. Blow that and then go what? Around here? Meet up with Peen. Oh, Battle Rose gets E-Bob. Oh, Scabby's where I think it's oh, Yes, Peen takes out Scabby as he tries to push through that door. Just got Battle Rose left. Up against two. Sixty seconds to play. I would say he may even keep his gun, trying to hold it. Looks like Axo wants that kill. He knows where he is now from the tracer line of those bullets. But he's not going to push in there alone. He's just trying to hope he gets another kill. He's going to run that clock down. In fact, he almost got a peak there. He doesn't have the EMP, so he cannot... The only way you can win is by taking them both out. Oh, nade comes out. Too far away. And he concedes that round. Hybrid takes six points. And Moogie with four. He'll hold on to that gun. Oh, those Vezins aren't cheap. Uh, Chase Attack moves to 13 kills. Uh, closely followed behind by Peen with 12. Insung on the other side with 10. And Scabby with 8. Who's got the most assists? That would be Ebob with 6. Emil, she got a kill. I wonder who that was. And they'll be <laughs> extremely disappointed, I'm sure. Anyway, this could be the last round. If Hybrid wins, they will lock this one away. Moogie has still got a chance to draw at least, but they need to win the next two rounds. Got a bot it's gonna push in that stairway and it looks like Sensum is gonna stay handy maybe. Oh we've got Scabby doing long range stuff. Is that someone in already? No, he's out on the other side. Bit of wall bang going on. Scabby picks up E Bob. Where from? Okay, the 
pushed in. I might have got him through that doorway. I've been staying tight on site. It's like all four of them are on site. I don't know where the fifth is. Oh, fifth is dead, e Bob, of course. Couple coming up the stairway. Trying to push in. Oh, well, that's the bot. That's the bot's a little bit smarter. What a cadillo, too. It's a one tap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's pushing out? Oh, yes, Chase gets battle roads through the through the uh, family room. Oops, Abby's trying to pick someone up through the connecting hallway. Mills decided she's out of there. Oh, there it is. Inside the corner where you were. Oh, look at that. Emil takes out Chase Attack. Oh, he'll never look that one. <laughs> Ping gets a meal. And Insung. Oh, his Insung was crossing across. And. Oh, Scabby. He's the only one left. As Ping takes out Cambo, so. Up against three. It's not looking good. I nearly got pain. Oh, there it goes. Pain, get him right through that funny angle, right through that broken door. It's a killer. Killer. Hybrid take the win. They win in, uh, what is it, hideout. Uh, we'll have a quick look at the scores uh, once we get back to the lobby. 7-4. Uh, Good showing from Mamugi. They, uh, they took the lead there, of course, at one stage there, so... They are in the hunt. Keen to see what this next map is. Funny place to spawn way out here. Anyway, let's get a load of these scores, shall we? All right, Peen. Uh, looks like we are swapping servers, maybe. Everyone seems to be dropping fairly quickly, so let's get through these before we get kicked out of here. Peen with 16 kills, Chase with 14, Insung with 10, Scabby with 9. Axolotl with eight, and we're out to the lobby. lobby. <laughs> uh, you can pause that back anyway on the stream, so uh, I'm sure you will do that. Now we will look for the next lobby. We'll be on a different server. I have a feeling that was Sydney, but I could be wrong. Uh, it's definitely not Squizzies. Ping is 18, so I would say they were probably playing on either San Jose or Hong Kong, maybe, maybe, I'm only guessing. Couldn't see any ping issues my end, it didn't look like it was uh, delayed at all, in fact it looked pretty bloody good. Anyway, we are now on Sydney, <clears throat> as you can tell by the nice green 18 to 20 ping. Not sure if there's going to be any subs. I wasn't told if there's going to be any subs. It'd be bloody nice if a Moogie could get their fifth. Uh, meanwhile, let's have a look at the voting. We're going to find out in about eight seconds' time what our map is going to be. Fifth. 
factory. Good old factory. Boy, chat's been busy. I've been ignoring chat completely. Sorry. Oh, yes. <laughs> we caught it on stream. <laughs> it's always funny when someone gets killed by the bot. Uh, but look, they're vicious. Man, they are. They are extremely vicious. They will spin 180 degrees and snap you on the head in the blink of an eye. And you always go, what the hell was that? <laughs> anyway, we're in a factory. And we have... Uh, looks like Astra joins the party. Astra, Skits, Mix, Chase, Bailey, E-Bob, that taking on Battle Rose, Gabby, Cambo, Insung, and this time it's jo uh, Bot Jonathan. Let's see if he can get a kill, eh? <laughs> Bottom floor, one of my favorites. Got hybrid defending and a movie attacking. I think they started the uh, hideout map the other way around, so let's see what a movie's attacking strats on factory are gonna be like. I think they're really close. Uh, see, that's. It's elusive death. Oh, nade comes in. They rotate that out of there quickly. No one takes any damage. There's three of them still pushing in. Ebog's going to cop one of them. Oh, Melrose takes out Chase. Where did that happen? I would say he was probably tucked up there. And we've got Insong. He's pushed right in straight away. Peeking that door. In fact, Jonathan's pushed in the other side. He gets taken out by Bailey. E Bob gets in song in the other door, and we've got a 4v2. There's the other two right there. Actually, it's three. Ah. Oh, wow. 2v2. Taken out by Cambo. He gets the other one. He gets gets across. Takes the double. And the first round for a movie. Looks like Scabby got the plant off as well, which will bring some, mean some extra points for the team, I do believe. Still haven't worked out how exactly that works, so. San Jose, we see in chat, was the last server. I didn't even notice that, so there you go. They're playing on an American server. Which is uh, very rarely that much fun. Especially compared to an Australian server, anyway. Latency's a killer in these high reflex games. Ebob and Bailey looks like Ebob's gonna station himself around vending machines as the window goes down. No, he's out of there. Scabby's got the long range skip. Mix picks up the bot. Because I'm sure the bot was being overly aggressive. Pushing into vending. I'm not going to get any. Oh, there's a drone down gun. Yeah, there's a drone. So they'll be shooting. Got E Bob and Astra holding one of the bombs. Oh, Cambo gets Astra down the corner. Where was that from? Gabby 
Gabby takes out Bailey across the boxes as the nade comes in. Does a little bit of damage to Chase. Not a, oh yeah, half damage. Oh, Chase gets battle runners though. Meanwhile, Scabby gets the refrag on that one. Nearly gets taken out. He's lost some health. He's bad. In fact, he's the last one for a movie. Ooh. He's taking shots from both angles. No, oh, it's only a matter of time. I think Skits Mix takes him out and Hybrid get their first point for Factory. Two kills apiece, pretty much, for Hybrid. Camo's got four on the other side, though. Stairs, Bailey's doing the same. So Astra's gonna stay on B. Maybe not. Door blocker down. Skits mix is hanging around B. And Astra on A. Jonathan's gonna push into the bathroom. He's gonna get chased straight away. push in they don't realize that there's two people Bailey and Ebob upstairs but they're not sticking around though he's coming down orange although this is gonna yeah this is gonna end badly for Insong as Ebob takes him out didn't expect you to see anyone up there as you wouldn't but now Battle Rose knows that there's people in the lockers Goes over top, doesn't do anything. Try and get a bit of peek. Oh, and yes, Ebob picks up Battle Rose. He's on a f tear. Oh, and the other one, Astra, just got taken out. Cambo, what do we got left? Scabby on his own. What is he doing out here? He must be in the middle of a rotation. Still two up there. In fact, there's three now by the look of that. I think they're being joined by Chase, who's charging around. Scabby's going to walk through lockers and find Chase pretty quickly. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah. He gets it. Oh, oh. Astra gets the refrag for a win for Hybrid. Bob moves to four kills. Scabby and Cambo on the other team also with four kills. Yeah, the outlines are pretty cool. They certainly take a little bit of getting used to from a caster's perspective, I can tell you. It's a little bit hard to judge their depth to tell what room they're actually in. Uh, but it is really cool to see because you can see what they're doing. Very, <laughs> very clearly. Through the wall. Yeah. Amazing. Uh, Tijava. Now, he's new. He is. Joins the uh, Moogie team. So he must have been just running a little bit late. But uh, they'll certainly be glad to have his help. Grenades and smoke grenades and all sorts of things going on. Meanwhile, 
Hybrids all tied on side apart from I think there's one Roma. Oh no. Chase is going Roma. Someone out the other side. Well, they're pushing into storage. We've got two cleanly in. Three, actually. Nothing happening with the wall bangs. I'm going to have to blow that wall or push in through the door. Bang comes down. So here's the wall being blown. Gets on a nice tight angle. Astro picks up Scabby. Oh, Camo gets Bailey as well. There's another one over there. Tajava gets his first kill for on, on Chase. Just Insung and Java left. 2v2. One coming through Connector. Season. Oh, Ebob picks up Insung. It's just Tajava left. Where is he? He's just behind that wall. Gonna do the same push in, is he? Oh yeah, they know where he is now. I didn't tag him though. Astra picks him off for the win. Hybrid moved to three. E Bob jumps to six kills. We look at a second floor objective. I don't know what you call this area. Some sort of uh, lifting apparatus or something like that. So, no. A loading dock. That's a rail loading dock. So some sort of yeah, I don't know. someone's gonna have to come up with a clever name for it anyway 15 seconds to go Java on his own by the look of that battle rose might be joining him a couple on the roof three on the roof going to try and work their way down as in fact that's what they've done they've dropped going to work the orange stairs perhaps chase is trying to get another kill in the bathroom he might be able to peek tijava through that corner through that gap throws a nade in chase oh chase swings at the right time to take out tijava gets Astro. Battle Rose is going off. Where is he? Oh, right. I'm missing all the action. Even with all the outlines, I'm still missing the action. Cambo's probably going to get... No. He made it cleanly. Oh, what was that? It must have been a trip mine or something. That's crazy. So we've got down to a 2v2, Battle Rose and Insung. Insung's up one level. What's Battle Rose going to do? Looks like he's rotating back to B. He might get one in connector. takes out that static which is exactly what he needs but now it gives his position away insul takes out insul gets them both one was in connector he gets the plant off as well adds salt to the wound moogie move to two points Um, 
Winston got both those, and yet he's only got two kills with it. I can't believe that's the first kills. Can't be his first kills. Uh, anyway, we are on the final round, so they'll be spending all their money. Every cent they've got will go to waste if they take try and take it with them to the next round, because you can't do that. Uh, so we'll see uh, what looks like um, a full buy from Amugi as far as rifles and gadgets and uh, same with hybrid all got pheasants skits mix is probably the only one without a util but they got no money anyway i spent it all which is what you want to do Creeping in through bathroom. I would say they're looking for hatches to blow. All five of them are coming in nice and quiet. This is really interesting. See, there's three yellow players. Oh, we've got Skits Mix over here. In fact, he picks out Scabby. No, Scabby gets Skits Mix. Moving a lot quicker now. Whoa, next chase. Daddy got it here. An effective knave. Ebo. Ebob. Where did Ebob get that kill? V3, Insung takes out Astra. People still in sight. Start pushing in, they're pushing in hard. Darby's going straight on the beat. Gets Bailey in the connector. In fact, it's just. Who's it left? Ebob. Just Ebob. He takes out Insung. Takes some damage. He gets Scabby as well. Oh, he gets Battle Rose too. It's a 1v1. Just Tijava left. Can he? Clutch up. <laughs> Fifty seconds left. Where did TJ go? Where did he go? He's rotated into connector. He does not have the EMP. In fact, I think that's probably where Ebob is. He's just charged up his health. Is Ebob holding the EMP? No. Here they come. They're going to meet each other very shortly. This is where the lines are so great. Now, Ebob would have heard that transfer this. Bob manages to get a drop shot off of the team for the win. Hybrid moved to four points and we are switching sides. Ebop, 12 kills, only two deaths. He'll be happy about that. That's a nice KD. Scabby with seven kills. Camo with six. Who's got the most assists? Uh, three for Battle Rose and Chase. Moving in the hot seat with four points. Let's see what uh, Hybrid can do on attack. Is that all of them? 
No, maybe not. They're going out the back. back. Into the back window. Maybe through lockers as well. There is one in lockers. In some sort of time. E Bob for a cheeky kill. Throws a nade out as he retreats. Astra's going to try and peek that, but he's long gone. Oh no, he's coming back for more. He wants another kill. Bailey's going to have a go. Push in, and we've got action. Oh, and it's over the other side. Oh! Yeah. Pushes into the lockers. It's just Bailey and Astra, and they're up against Tijava. He's on his own. Astra is very low. He's only on 25 health points. Sorry, 10. 25 is how much cash he's got. Ball goes down. Plant goes on. Java's got one opportunity to stop it right now. <laughs> Uh, that says a Moogie win. They move to five. Um, that must mean they run out of time. I'm not quite sure what happened there. I wasn't watching the clock. I'll have to watch that one back. But yeah, I think uh, I think they didn't get the plant off in time. And the clock run down. She's there in the box seat to take this mat. Five points. got these backwards haven't we? It's definitely not fixed. Where is it? I don't know. Tell me chat. Chat, we got that backwards have we? Show hybrid were leading. Anyway, we'll fix it at the end of the round. Insung tucked into that corner nice and neatly, and Cambo's probably right behind the bomb. Yep. That's a nice little angle on that from the bomb. Looking straight out there. Two above the hands, two. And, oh, Battle Rose takes out Chase. Where did that happen? Oh, he's coming up the stairway. That's why Java gets Bailey. Skitsmix gets two. Go to a 3v3. So Java's up on the wrong floor, but so is E Bob. So they're going to run into each other, maybe. No, too far away. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. No, I've rotated out of there. I'm gonna foam that wall and blow through to the cafe. Battle right take that after. Gabby gets gets mixed. Evo gets the refrag, but hybrid take the win. Oh no. Hang on. Moogie got that one. So yeah, the names are backwards, aren't they? 
Yeah. I don't know if they've fixed that or why I've just got that stuffed up, but uh, uh, let's do that now. Boy, that was confusing. I wondered what was going on for a while. Uh, anyway, hopefully we've got that correct now. Someone uh, in chat just confirmed that that is correct because I don't dare get it wrong again. Uh, anyway, quick look at the scores. We've got uh, Scabby on 9 kills, Evo on 13. 13 and 4. Wow. Finding his form. All right, so we got one right underneath the, his nose. He's gonna jump. Chase is gonna jump in. He's looking. He's trying to see him. Oh, he does. He gets in there and gets him. Takes his gun too. It's a nice handy pickup because it looked like a vessel, I think. Uh, and he only he only had a uh, spectral to start off with. Um, the other four Moogie players are staying tight on site. Trying to get a bit of a wall bang on Chase. He returns the favour. Bailey gets Battle Rose. Where did that happen? Oh, connector in um, Jenny. Maybe. Broken that door blocker. I'm gonna blow that wall too, I imagine. We've got Insung in the little alcove. That was a nade. Didn't do anything. Cambo picks up Skitsnix. Where did that happen? Just when you think you're on top of the action. They not bring breaching foam. Surely not. Chase is in. He's trying to get the plant off. Insing is coming around. He gets Bailey. E Bob gets the refrag on Insing while Chase is still alive planting. Cambo is coming around, but it's too late. The plant is down. I really need that wall bang. Although wall banging that is actually a really good strat. Because as soon as he goes to defuse, he just shoots through the wall and kill him. Yeah. It's coming. And, uh, of course, Tijama knew that. And they knew the only way he's going to get him is to go out and try and take him out. Which is exactly what he did. And he runs straight into E-Bob. Which is exactly what they wanted. Hybrid moved to six. They cannot lose from here. They can only draw. And Moogie have three. So... Hybrid will be looking to wrap this one up early, I would say. And uh, take the next map or two, the next round or two to eventually take this map. Quickly, the score Scabby, nine kills, eight deaths. Insung and Battle Rose both on six. Cambo on seven kills. Still running a negative KD, he'll be disappointed about that. Ebob 14 and 4, that's a handsome KD for sure. Uh, Astra 8 and 6 running positive. As we've got 15 seconds before we kick into round number 10. Side to go to the roof. No, coming down the side again. We've got a few people tucked in the corner. No, where are they? Ah, connector, of course. Uh, I'm going to blow that hatch. That's interesting. Obviously, a distraction because they're not going to use it for. Ah. 
Meanwhile, there's one and two in the border, one in the boardroom at least, and we've got Chase who's going to push in. Innocent is tucked, he's taking some damage. Bailey ends up taking him out. Cambo's going to see if he can pop out and take him out of the boardroom. He ends up eating a bullet of e -bob. And we got a 5v3 hybrid in the hot seat. See, Java tastes that, takes out Chase, which evens it up slightly. Nade goes into Connector. That's a beauty, but it doesn't get anyone. Plant goes down, and I thought they might have blown that bottom. Oh, Astra picks up Battle Rose. Back we're down to one more, and that's it. Bailey takes out to Java for the win. Hybrid take factory, and they also won on hideout, so that means that they are the winners this evening. Quick splash of the scores. We'll come back to them again in the drone as we wrap up. Oh, yeah. Great win to hybrid solid strats. Uh, nothing too outlandish or, uh, un, um, or new or not rewriting the meta or anything, but they certainly put on a good show tonight. Quickly look at the scoreboard. Uh, e Bob is the star of the evening with six kill, 16 kills, four deaths, and five assists. Um, who was next? It would have been uh, Scabby on the other team with nine kills, nine deaths, running a neutral KD. He'll be happy about that. Uh, then we've got eight kills for Bailey, uh, seven for Battle Rose and Cambo on Amugi. And then back to um, six for Insung and Chase. And finally five for Skits and Tijava, who joined late anyway. Uh, so I'm sure they were happy to have him turn up. Anyway, uh, that's it. They've all buggered off, I'm sure. Uh, there's a few stragglers hanging around talking about it. Chewing the fat. You could see this one back on the big screen, I think. What do you think, folks? Enjoy the show? Did it go the way you thought it was going to go? Anyway, I will probably catch you all next weekend, and I'll try and cast another match. And uh, I think um, the only reason we won't see many more matches this cycle is or well, this weekend anyways, because they're both scheduled at the same time. So there was another match running on. Uh, it was Young Mafias and um, Soap Dispensers who were running at the same time. Be interesting to see how that one washed up. And uh, we've got another two matches. Legion, Both Legion P and Legion I are taking on 7DS and... Um, can't remember who we're, we're taking on. Uh, but yeah, that's on tomorrow night at... 8 p.m. I believe Eastern Standard, Australian Eastern Standard. So don't be uh, someone. Actually, we don't have a caster. So if there's a caster listening, wants to pick up one of those matches, we'd love to see it. So, by all means. <laughs>